back up. Hello YouTube, welcome and welcome back to the Big King Family Channel. I'm here today with a Walmart haul. Um, we went out today just to pick up a few items. Um, I'm just gonna go ahead and get started. Um, right here we have these uh, great value uh, stack attacks. Stack attack, I did not know they were named that. But anyway, stack attacks, they're only a dollar a can. So I picked up like six cans. Uh, my son, Dunabug, he loves to uh, eat the veggie chips that come in this little can like this. They're called veggie chips, and they're like $2.19 a can, but these are only $1 a can. So, um, and he loves them. So, this is what I'm going to go with half the price and still not too bad on the carbs and different things like that. I'll tell you about, about my little diet plan later. I, I've been switching up on diet plans here and there. First, I wanted to do low carb, low sodium. I want to do that, and then I wanted to do keto, and then I, that was way too much for me. So then, so now what I want to do is try to count calories every day. 2,000 calorie, cal calorie diet every day. Try to stick with 2,000 calories, and you're going to burn some of that every day. So you should slowly but surely lose some weight the healthy, smart way. But anyway, we'll get into that later. Um... I have the 7-Up and this Dr. Pepper is mine. The 7-Up is um, Cheyenne's, okay? Next, we have this um, pack of underwear for Ducey. It's, if you look real close, it's the mesh, stretchy type stuff. Not He liked the box of Breeze for men, but they come in cotton. My husband wore the cotton ones, but he said he really liked these stretchable ones. It kind of stretched, so hey, more power to him. And he's a big boy, so he got a size, a size large, you know. He's a big boy. All right, and he's 12, about to be 13. All right, we also, me and my daughter picked up some Esther underwear. She got the boy short ones, and she got a size 5. And I got uh, some of the box of brief, some of the brief ones. They're a size 7. They had to tape this up. You know how folks be getting into stuff in Walmart. So I just went ahead and um, picked those up. And what sits come in there, and I will get the prices for you right over here in a minute because I got my receipts over there. All righty. All right, moving along. My son is trying to come into the room and stuff. See, it's right on the bed right here. Get out of that trash can. Get out. Duna. 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 Get out. Bye bye. Okay. All righty. So, next we have the imitation vanilla flavoring. And the imitation to me is just as good as the original, um, the real vanilla flavoring. And do you know that the imitation vanilla flavoring lasts six months longer than the um, the pure vanilla extract? The pure vanilla extract, I believe, has a shelf life of about one year. But the imitation has a shelf life of about a year and a half. You can look that up. You know, I, I think the shelf life for it is a lot longer. And this was only 98 cents at Walmart. We can double check on this um, receipt. So, But that's a really good deal. All right. So then next we needed some washcloths for the um, kitchen. What I do, I switch mine up as needed. Just as needed. At the Dollar Tree, you can get two for a dollar, which is awesome. They look kind of like this, you know, just two of them in the pack for a dollar, I think. I think it's two in that pack for a dollar. So I had to make them 50 cents each. So I might have got messed up with this deal these were 2.92 at um walmart so uh 50 uh, that made them about 80 cent each which i was thinking was a good deal because i at, at the dollar tree i'm gonna have to double check that and see if you get two or only one dish towel for a dollar but anyway i was just trying to get a better deal but these were 292 for four of them and these will last for a while every time it just looked like it's getting icky Ew. I see where people wash them, and that's their prerogative. But me, just every time I see them getting dirty, I just buy new ones. And I probably have to do that. I don't have to do that no more than I may say four times a year or three times a year. Because you know, if I'm buying a four pack, you know, it might we may switch them out every month. But this will be four months worth, you know. So you know, just buy some more dishcloths. And I found this the bigger, better deal. 
um these t-shirts i think it's five in here and i think it was on sale for the 7.99 it was i think it rung up for 7.99 for five t-shirts that is awesome that's only like a dollar and some change per shirt and you know these things normally won 15 or 20 dollars for that five pack and they're size large these are just for Ducey to kind of put up under his uh school shirts but uh, he can actually worm around the house, too, with his gym shorts. Okay, I'm going to set the phone down a little bit because I want to make sure it's five shirts in here. Okay, right now, this won't take very long. I'm just going to rip that $7.99 sticker off. And then what I wanted to do is see if it was really five shirts in here. Because I know how they be doing. They be doing too much. Let me get it up off the bed a little bit because I don't want to shake the bed too much. If this is five shirts for just dollars and change, each brand new. It's a really awesome deal. So, here we go. Oh, and it's a big, good size. One, I know Ducey will be able to get in these. Two, three, and, and, and. It's only four, but I still think four for $8. It's a really good price. $2 each for brand new shirts. Plus, they're really good. Oh, my gosh. They, they feel so good. The quality feels so good on them. So, I'm still real happy with that deal. So, don't be afraid to shop the clearance. And don't be afraid to pick up stuff that's um, off-brand. So, because I sure do. Now, we can look at the receipts. Okay, last but not least, I did not have the... I didn't have the prices for the underwear and stuff, so I just wanted to kind of show y'all. I told y'all that those were a dollar, and I think those were like a dollar twenty-five. They used to just be ninety-eight cents, but they don't bump them up to like a dollar twenty-five. And then the underwear, I just wanted to kind of know where I was at on those. But I see right here they were nine ninety-six a pay. I did not know they was that expensive. Whew. I knew those dishcloths were just two ninety-two. Uh, the underwear was marked down to eleven ninety seven from fifteen ninety eight. So I got a little roll back on that, but I still thought almost twelve dollars was too high for um three pair of underwear. But anyway, I know that stuff is how it is what it is. And then the five pack which ended up just being a four pack was seven ninety nine, which I think was still a pretty good deal. So I'm gonna go ahead with that. Here go all these uh chip canisters for just a dollar. And that imitation vanilla was only ninety eight cents. And then it's eight ounces, eight fluid ounces a pretty big little thing of it too. So all right. So yeah, I was I was getting cash back on a lot of this stuff. So that's why I got two or three. You know how you do it. You go in there, you gotta pick up what you need, and then you gotta get your cash back. But on a day when you need all your cash, you definitely go in there. Yeah, I know what I'm talking about. And you get the only dollar twenty-five cent um uh it, it's a root beer right here. And my daughter Carlanda was with us, the one we called Cindy. Uh Cindy was with us, and she got that and took it on home with her because we had just picked her up from work. And then I got $20 off the card right there. And right here is where I got our 7-Up and our Dr. Pepper. They don't bumped them up to $1.25. Those things used to be only $0.98. Cent. And then I got $100 cash back. All righty. So this is my Walmart haul for this evening. Thank you all for watching. I love y'all, and talk to you later.